the world of bodybuilding, where age is merely a number and determination knows no bounds. Today, we bear witness to an inspiring back workout session led by two seasoned veterans of the fitness world. In this sacred space where iron and resilience collide, we see the embodiment of lifelong dedication to physical fitness. John and Jimmy, both older in years but young at heart, serve as a testament to the enduring power of the human spirit. As the weights are lifted and the muscles engage, their bodies carry the wisdom of years spent honing their craft. With every rep, they defy the notion that age is a barrier, showcasing the remarkable potential within each of us, regardless of the calendar. Lines of experience grace their faces, a visual reminder of the countless workouts, victories, and setbacks that they've encountered along their fitness journey. It's a testament to the resilience of the human body and the unwavering passion that propels them forward. Their bodies sculpted through years of commitment move with grace and precision. Each rep echoes a story of perseverance, reminding us that the age does not dictate our potential. With determination, discipline, and proper training, we can continue to strive for greatness, no matter our stage in life. Yeah. 
It is. Right? On no matter the weight. It's yeah. gotta be the same. It's gotta be the same. At the end of the day, I know it's, I know it's pretty, pretty crazy what I'm saying. The weight really feels the same. Right? Yeah. But as soon as you lock in, the weight's the same as the previous set. <laughs> Traps hanging off his body. Well, that's from deadlift. Right. That's where you get those. I can't shrug enough to get there. And I, at our age, you shrug now, your neck is gone. If you, yeah. if you shrug enough to get there. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's see what I get. Scared than than uh, that's a strong, you know. You know? Yeah. That's the thing I wrestle with every day. Every time I get a small bar, every time I do something heavy like this, that's why it's so easy to do the other stuff. Say, right? Like that first rep for me, I was terrifying. Like, yeah, terrifying. Yeah. Because you've been to the injury. I remember what it took to stand up after that first back surgery. It was hard here as much as physical. And that's the thing that it's like you gotta get out of your head. It's um it's like the, the coaches tell people in football, if you ease up, you get hurt. Yeah. Unless you go all out. If you're gonna do this, do it. You're not gonna do it. Yeah, it's okay. That, that three fifteen, it was heavy, don't get that's me wrong. Heavy. But in my head, I, I never would have put it on if I wasn't yeah. here. You know? And I wouldn't do this. So if you get hurt, it's my fault. It's your fault. Being hurt. Tighten up before you fall. Nothing loose. Tighten up. That's fine. <laughs> Two. Two, yeah. I'll do two plates. Yeah. I, right. I like that. I the first day I did these again. Middle of my back. Middle traps. Uh -huh. Like middle middle of my four o'clock in the morning. What did I do? There. Right. Oh yeah, I did It's different. You know. I've I've had some conversations lately. Thing. Last year, the machines have destroyed a lot of, of high-level bodybuilding, yeah. like quality. It's, it's too easy to. There's no balance. There's no. You got to go. You got to go. Secondary muscles in play. Yeah, that's the challenge we got here. There's so much variety. Right. And then you tend to neglect the barbells. It's like, all we, all we that's what got me. That's what got me. There. All we have is barbells and dumbbells. Yeah. You know. So they at least have to be part of it. And now you're getting ready for a show with all machines. Yeah. I want to turn mine. Oh. 
Get in there and try.
you notice, I'm not out of breath. I see that one. Because my cardiovascular is superior. It's spot on. And I'm hurt having two ventricles. Well, two left ventricles help. And running four miles every morning. You know, it helps. You know, I told you, get up and run every morning. You know, and you want no part of that. I'm going to bleed you. This is a good one. This guy's out of control. This is a good one. We're having a blast. Two old men. Two old men going at it. You might be old. But you still kick your asses in. Right? Whatever gym is. Whatever gym is. I might get you in trouble. Excuse me, sir. I'm wondering if you have any of that beauty fit, beauty heat. Would you like to take a picture with you? Do you want to take a picture with me? Yeah, what? Do you want to take a picture with me? Yeah. The famous oh, there you go. Just say hi. The famous Jimmy Memphis. Hi. hi. I'm so honored. Listen, I heard you have a company called Beauty Fit. Yes. And they have a really wonderful product called Beauty Heat. Oh, I'm sorry. There you go. I was too busy. Make sure. Fans, fans, go first. I was, yeah, I was too busy taking care of my fans. I don't. Then why'd you pick them today? Uh, I don't do them because I'm not good at them. Are you? And maybe, you, maybe you put too much weight. As a and, that, and, that's, and that's too much. I do too little weight. As a consequence, my back is weak there. No. And therefore, I'm going to get better at them. You know, I never put more than a 45 on here. Because all you gotta do is roll this. I know. You know, what you're trying to, what everybody else is trying to do is trying to pull it all the way up for this. Yeah. It's this. No, I'm trying to do the top. Get in the top. So your elbows don't go back. Your elbows come forward, okay? Forward. Go. Forward. Can I do something real fast? Yep. Drag it. There. Drag it. You're not, drag it. You're pulling. Drag it. Slow. Right there. Back down. Again. Right there. Come on. Right there. Come on. Okay. Can either one of them sleep that off? That's permanent. <laughs> See what I'm saying? Oh, absolutely. I feel it. We were so focused on oh, yeah. this. Everybody does this. Is this? Yeah. Is this right here? It's a shrug. It's a T-bar. Unfortunately, I'm going to put it the end of my career. Yeah. Okay, you're at the beginning. Which one? The senior citizens one? Uh huh. Let's You know what I'm saying? No, I did. Don't rush yeah, it. Right. And it's not a full rep. No. Your traps are moving this, not your arms. Pulling the ball. Keep your arms alone. Do this. Flex this. Right there. That's it. Right there. One rep at a time.
Maybe we should throw another one down. Yeah. Or maybe just throw another one just as part of that. I think we could pick it up like that. Could you imagine if it was flipped? It's one of those hundreds. Huh? One of those hundreds. Watch that back. No problem. That's Jack. What do you mean that's Jack? Oh, give me a couple shots at this. Coach ain't letting me have a good time. Coach, 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 coach sees me doing good. It takes me up this, awkward, yeah, it takes me somewhere I'm uncomfortable. Come on now. Come on. Show me. Show me the way. Here is the door. Tracking our back, we're not, yeah, it's our yeah, arms. It's arms yeah. So, you know what? Right. Yeah, let's do the other one different. Pump them out. Yeah, I want you to see that difference. Yeah. when I get to that place I usually quit and that's it's 10 seconds 10 seconds you're gonna meet the bear you're not when I you decide I, I, I'm even doing it now right? not that much but you know not that deep but every time legs you know biceps you know that you ain't get that burn I count 10 from there yeah that's it, you know? Good. You know, you know, 
the stuff that I know now, sometimes I kick myself in the ass, because the stuff that I know now, if I can go back, because see now, the last 10 years have allowed me, no pressure, right? Because, because there's no time frame for me, right? To try this, let me try this, you know? If, uh, I'm telling you, I got goosebumps. If I allow myself to eat more food. Well, you're doing photo shoots everything. Yeah. Like, well, hey, we need you Thursday. Well, okay, yeah. no burger today. I mean, the two years out of the out of the good, let's say you had, I mean, I'm competing for 20 some years, right? But I had a good seven years, yeah. let's just say. Out of the good seven years I, I've been peaked, I think I've eaten two off seasons. Yeah. Right. Right. You know, yeah. and if I allowed myself to eat more food, I'm talking about junk food. Yeah, I'm talking about food. Just right? yeah, more rice. Yeah, more chicken. Yeah, more steak. More oh yeah, yeah. Remember when I hurt my back for four days? Well, I hurt my back yeah. a lot of times. But one day it was four days, right? And I just kept eating at the house. The next day I went back into the gym. I was up ten pounds. I looked leaner because I filled out. The water pulled in the muscles. And I'm like.
since you're sitting here. Little secret, not a secret, but so when you train back, you get the hand grip. You see a lot of people pulling with their fingers. Okay? And that movement, that resistance stays here. Okay, you don't feel anything here. Take your hand and put it on your palm and grip it. So in other words, instead of here, you're here. And the resistance, I feel already, coming from the rear delt and lats. So when you guys grip the handles for back, even for back, come on top of it, get on top of it. You got a row, get over it, not your fingers. The ball of your hands right here. Grab it and pull. See the difference? To this. This to this. Try it. Big difference. That's the men. That's the mentis minute for now. Um, either way, I've done both. The key here is where you put the pad. Okay. So the lower right. pad like goes. A, it's like a hyperextension, yeah. right? Got so it. if you've got this above your right. hip joint, you right. bend it at the hip joint. Got it. So I need to go higher. Yep. So I can get it right in the lower back. It's basically a stand up hyperextension. It's a standing high, It's like a good morning with a jet yes. control over it. Yes. So I'll just right, yeah. right here. Got it. And I'm going to pull it down like this in front. Got it. Peace out.